My name is David Wester, and we're missionaries in Honduras. If you looked at our first video, you know that we're trying to build an aquaponic garden. And one of the first problems we ran into was that we couldn't find plastic big enough to fit in our hole. And so uh, the plastic here comes in rolls that are about 36 inches, but it's a tube. And so I bought two pieces of rolls, cut down the middle, and now I'm trying to glue them together or seam them together. And so I found this on the internet uh, of how to, to seam it together. And basically, you take some parchment paper and an iron and you fold the parchment paper over the plastic and then with an iron heat it and melts it together. We tried it right here, if you can see, and it seemed to have worked really well. Uh, we're going to pause it for a second, kind of straighten up our plastic, and then we're going to do one more section for the video. So uh, stay tuned. Um, I'm back again. So what we've done is, we've uh, in the video that we watched, it said to use an ironing board. Well, we don't have an ironing board here in Honduras. And it's we're trying to seam a piece of plastic that's 20 feet long. So I laid a towel onto the floor, and also in the video that we saw, they were taking two pieces of plastic like this and putting them together with a seam right down the middle. And what I am doing is I'm making a double seam. So I'm folding it over like that. Then it says to use some parchment paper, which is what we have here. Interesting, we had to go to uh, a big town to find this at a special American type store because parchment paper is not available here where we live. In fact, there's not many things available where we live. So anyway, we fold it like that, fold this over that, and my iron is already hot. And it's pretty simple. It just takes a few seconds with a hot iron to melt that plastic together. And, uh, and then it takes a few minutes to cool it off. I've got about a two foot piece of parchment paper here. And, uh, and I'm trying to do about two foot at a time. So it'll take us a few minutes. Uh, and then we're going to, later on this evening, we're going to try to place it into our hole that we've already dug outside. So let me show you here. I don't want it to leak, so I'm taking extra precaution to make sure I, I get it melted good. It, it's still soft, and if you try to pull it, it will stretch it, and I don't want to stretch it, so... I'm going to cool it off just a little bit more. Yeah, there you go. So there's the, there's the seam right there. And it, it seems like it's a really good seam as far as I can tell. So anyway, whenever I get the whole thing seamed together, we're going to take it out this uh, evening or first thing in the morning and uh, try to place it in our hole and see if we put water in it and if it will hold water. So anyway, uh, check out our, our uh, other YouTubes, and uh, our website is dcwester.com, and we've got some pictures and some newsletters there, so uh, uh, check us out. Thanks, and God bless. Bye.